Let's Batman begins. They're giving us the fucking Arkham style suit. Oh my god. Comics Plus, what is going on? I am the Aquaman. What is going on, guys? Comics Plus, Aquaman here in the house today. We have a very, very special reveal. Uh, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. That would be great <laughs> because you're about to witness one of my all-time favorite things to do, and that is talk about the Batman. Very, um, very interesting um, about the timing and such. As I grabbed my shirt, and this was the first shirt staring at me, looking at me, everything. My phone has been blowing up all goddamn morning. And I just woke up, and it is time to take a look and see how uh, the new reveal of the Ma Matthew Reeves film, The Batman, uh, how it's going to, this is, uh, I guess this is going to be the bat suit reveal, the first look at Robert Pat Pattison, right? Or Pattison, as we like to call him. Um, as the Batman. So, um, I don't have anything queued up on my TV because, uh, one of the biggest problems is when you, uh, click on it, go to YouTube, everybody spoils it in the thumbnail. So this is going to be 100% pure, authentic reaction, courtesy of the iPhone. Um, we're just going to take a look here. Uh, shout outs to Sly Spy on, um, my discord if you're not part of that that's where i get most of my information shout out to slot Sly, Sly spy who uh private messaged me the perfect i guess vimeo link so hold on it's gonna take a second it's gonna take a second here all right so this is on v vimeo all right all right here we go 
camera test from me. Okay, so it's a camera test. All right, here we are. 50, 50, 56 seconds. Do this. Uh, what should I do? Should I move over here? Do you want that one like that? You guys want it like that? All right. Man, I still remember the first time I did uh, the uh, bat flick uh, reveal. And I remember the Dark Knight. I'm glad that, that the internet wasn't as prevalent as it was when um, the Dark Knight reveal or the um, Batman Begins bat suit came out. Because, man, people tore that shit apart because they were showing the prototype suit. But, um, yeah, we'll talk about that another time. Let's go. Sounds like Westworld. Okay. Okay. I can see that. Okay, I see what they're going for. Ooh. Wow. Okay. You can definitely see the jawline. Like, that's definitely Robert. Okay. 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 You know what? My first reaction is to the I got a point. That's definitely going to be the thumbnail because, oh my God, you can tell that's iconic Batman like music. Dun, 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 dun. It's not as chamber hall style as we're used to, but it's still enough. Now, interesting enough, though, um, one of the uh, one of the things I was also thinking about here was it was um, it was very Daredevil like. It kind of reminded me of Daredevil, which is not a bad thing because Daredevil sometimes reminds me of Batman. So it, 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 it's all it's all uh, relative. Um, shit, let's just one more time. Let me see if I can blow it up. That Westworld style, though. Oh fuck! I didn't even have the I didn't even have the brightness all the way up. Now I can really see. Oh my god! Yeah, right here. It looks like kind of like Daredevil. I did not see that the first time around. But you can see, okay, I like, yo, they're giving us the fucking Arkham style suit. Oh my God. I did not realize this the first time because the settings were so low. Holy shit. Look at that. Plating. The collar has a, a very Damian Wayne kind of look, a very uh, Nightfall, um, um, uh, Injustice kind of style. This part. Okay, okay, you know what? This is interesting. This is interesting. I did I I didn't see that the first time around. Like he was already appearing. Like I was like, it was fucking dark the first time around. Oh my god. They're giving they're giving us the fucking like arc of, that's that's becoming my, my, my backdrop right now. Hey, backdrop! Now there you go. There you go. That is fucking sick. Yo. So we're essentially getting, we're getting like a merger. Now I can't, now I can't, I can't get Daredevil out of my mind now. <laughs> like looking at this, um, because we, we didn't see the ears. So did, did they show it? Not a, a little bit. They showed the ears though, but fuck man. So, um, Here's a, so here's the thing. Here's the thing. There's certain things as, you know, I'm probably probably one of the most critical Batman fans on the goddamn planet. Um, so I'm giving certain things a pass uh, because I know, um, I know, um, you know, this is supposed to be more of an or origin story, a little bit of a retelling, right? And, um, like, um, it's going to be, like, from the, from the get-go again, from the beginning. So, um, you know, the, 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 the idea that he kind of, he looks a little smaller, uh, than we're used to, uh, 
and particularly that's obviously because of the uh, Snyder, uh, the back click that uh, Snyder gave us, which was really kind of blown up and uh, had the whole uh, bodysuit on him and things like that. So we're going back to the kind of like the armored style of Batman, which I per personally I like. And what's so great about that is that we're getting the, the Arkham style. It looks to see like we're actually, it's weird because we're kind of jumping around, right? A little bit, even with the Arkham games, the first game, which is still Batman in his prime. Um, he wasn't. You, he was still using more of a bodysuit or, or, you know, the like uh, Kevlar mesh underneath uh, clothing, right? Uh, which is a little weird because it seems like we're kind of jumping, right? Like to to the uh, Arkham Knight style bat suit, which is like super protective. Uh, but it'll be interesting to see how far they go in with this because. Um, Obviously, with the original trilogy or the Nolan trilogy, uh, there was that was always a big situation about Kevlar mesh protection and um, military grade work. It'll be interesting to see how they go about handling this because obviously, yeah, it's been what 10 15 years or so since uh, that trilogy, and um, times have changed, technology has changed, and Obviously, if you're a multi-million dollar man, uh, billionaire or whatever, you'd uh, you'd uh, be investing in this kind of uh, uh, technology as well. If you're being running through the streets, beating, uh, beating the shit out of people. Uh, so this is interesting. But the the jawline, the collar thing is, it, uh, I find that kind of interesting. Um, I like uh, it's a it's it's a variant. It's definitely a variant. Uh, it re it reminds me of a few different. Uh, few different Batman, uh, particularly Gotham Knights. That's one of them, the animated series. Or one of the Japanese artists drew that same kind of color style. Uh, it's an interesting take on the Batman, but I think it also gives a good um, excuse for the neck turning situation. Um, to be able to turn the neck and it won't look like um, kind of corny or so. Uh, the, the Nolan trilogy of the Dark Knight version where he could start turning his head, you know, was uh, very influenced by motorcycles. And, uh, but I also feel like it lost a little bit of its scariness um, of having just this dude like fucking stare at you and shit. It lost some of its scariness, so it'll be interesting to see. Um, is there anything else I can break down from this? Nah, I think... Yeah, I'm just, I'm, 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 I'm shocked that we're actually getting an Arkham style, Arkham game style. <laughs> this mic, this mic is surpassing. Just based on, based on this alone, this might end up being. Let's Batman begins.